channel. Clearly, I'm in a different location and right now you can't really see it. Here are all of my new bookshelves and clearly um, they're empty. In today's video, you're going to be seeing me completely fill up my brand new bookshelves in my brand new apartment and don't ask for um, a move-in like tour of my apartment because that's already coming. This is actually currently going to be like in the middle of the process. Like this video itself isn't going to be in it, but like the bookshelves are going to be in it. So like you'll see that soon in my new apartment. But today's video, you're going to be seeing me unpack all my books and putting them up here. So the plan is to do my normal rainbow bookshelves, but instead of like having them like I did, these are all going to be red and it's going to go to purple. So instead of having like red and then the next color and the next color, it'll be like red, 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 and then shift over. And like all of the black and white books are going to be on the bottom shelf. As you can see down below, there's like a bigger area. So for that for now, because I have, I have a puppy, I'm going to leave it empty so like she can't destroy anything, but yeah. So like I have four bookshelves, there's five, technically four shelves on each, so I should be able to fill them. If not, I think I'm going to try to go on eBay and like look for extra shelves that fit these bookshelves. These are currently all of my books, not this. The socks in my printer, but all of these totes are my books, and they are. I took them like off the bookshelves, like organized, so like they should be. This should go by pretty fast. Yes, yeah, so I have five full totes of books. I have a total of 220 books. I took count. I'm currently missing two because my sister has them to read them, obviously. But yeah, these are all my books. All right, I gotta go to work in two hours, so I'm going to. Or not two hours. I gotta go to work at four. It's currently. 1.30, so I am going to get started. But my first tote, I'm opening. I'm also going to be setting, like, so under the red, I'm going to have the white books, and it's going to be, like, going to black over there, because, like, a lot of my purple books are, like, a dark purple, so, like, it will look better, like, it will blend better, if that makes sense. bookshelf just had like collections together that like weren't like red so like I have a lot of those but they have like red accents but they're going to be going to the black area over there so like just let you guys know a lot of these are like obviously not organized and like the vampire academy series I just got so like they weren't organized into my bookshelves so that's gonna happen with a few of my things I have them all in the book set in my last bookshelf. So these are all actually going to be color coordinated now. Thank you. 
debating about making a bookshelf specifically for my Sarah J Mass Corso sponge because it's only one of the three I have. But I don't know where I'm gonna put this. I might just make it this shelf down here because I have like decorations and stuff that I also will be putting on here. that like so this book is black but it has like red on it because like the blacks and the whites are kind of strange so i'm gonna try to like if they fit into that color section i'm gonna try to put them in there but like the whole bottom row looks kind of wanky right now so like i said we're gonna have to wait to the end but i'm kind of like thinking like if the black books have like colored lettering i might just put them in those sections Okay, so my camera just like stopped working for a second. So, but I just finished up the fourth tote and that's what this looks like so far. Yesterday, the girl in the headlines, and they'll never catch us. So, I'm also gonna have to find places for these. <laughs> okay, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. This is gonna be interesting. Um, I think I'm gonna go with my plan and just like everything that's like a black or white book, just put it in the color section that like is the writing on the spine. I'm gonna try that, see how it looks afterwards. I don't even know where to start with this. and stuff for my bookshelf, so maybe I'll open that and see 
what that looks like. regarding time, like I said, I work at four, but I'm good right now. Scissors, I just have my scissors. busy, you know? Thank you so much for watching this video. I know it's probably not as organized as it could be, but still. And it obviously, like, it didn't take me that long to organize it because, like, I already had them, like, organized somewhat, well, like, when I took them out of the totes. So that's good, obviously. If you guys have any recommendations about what I should do about the mess of the bottom shelf, leave that down below. I'm super excited that I actually have bookshelves now. Shout out to Seth for building them for me because I didn't want to do it and he did it well without work, so thank you. Yeah, I'm super excited that I have actual bookshelves. Comment down below what your bookshelves look like and how you organize them. Like this video and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye!